Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, this is from Lomax, and uh, thanks for watching. Uh, in today's episode, I would like to talk about uh, the filament run out, you know, the awning. And uh, before we get started, I really hope that you can check our YouTube channel and subscribe, you know, hit the bell and uh, give a big thumb up. Thumb up. Anyway, uh, let's get started. So when you get the printer, and uh, you will, you know, set up everything, right? This rack and this rack, and you're gonna start, uh, you know, print. And here, give me a second. And uh, we have, uh, for example, the model. I'm going to print this by color. How about the hot dog? Not hot dog, sorry. So you will see this earning, and it said, you know, filament run out. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't see it very clearly. It's right there. So the reason why you know you will receive this uh, alert is that you know uh, right now we send out our machines. Uh, you know by default uh, we set uh, two extr extruders. I'm going to switch off. Okay. So by default we will get uh, you know uh, a 3D printer with uh, you know dual extruders. So in the firmware we set uh, you know extruders like two instead of one. But previously, you know, on Kickstarter, you know, other platforms, we usually, you know, sell, you know, the second extruder as an add-on. So anyway, in order to address these problems or issues, the uh, answer is really, really simple. And you just cut, you know, uh, a few, a filament like this, and you pull it through like this, all right? And you see the red light goes on, right? And this is... Uh, the filament sensor, as you can see, there is a connector with wires, you know, to help, you know, sense this filament. Uh, if it runs out, you know, it will just send an alert and everything. So when you put it through, you know, with a bolting tube, and you, you're you going to start printing again. And here is the result. And I hope the problems can be solved. And this dog, I'm going to print. And now you can see it goes all right, and it's printing precise, right? Thank you, thank you so much, and I hope this tutorial really help you solve the problems. And if you need other assistance, and you're welcome to contact our official, and uh, I'll see you guys next time.